It's been quite a while, but we're back. Hello everybody, welcome back to Wii Party. Instead of Wii Party U, we're gonna be playing Wii Party today again, because today we're gonna be completing Globetron. Do you remember the poll I made about two weeks ago? Maybe longer? I asked in that poll what video you guys wanted to see for the third anniversary of our channel, and Wii Fit U came out on top. Wii Party Globetrot, however, uh, was in second. And seeing as you guys apparently want to see that, might as well play this, seeing as I don't have a lot of other games to play. Let's begin with Beginner. Ooh, we're gonna be playing against Tommy. Sounds fun. Wii Party says this game takes about an hour to complete. Let's see if that holds true. So our starting point is America. Oh, well, North America. Hello and welcome to Globetrot. Since this is your first time playing, I'll explain how this game works. Please do. In this game, you travel around the world visiting many different countries along the way. To move players, to, <coughs> to move, players select one of their face-down cards and move the, uh, the number of space on the card. The goal is to visit as many hotspots as possible. When you land on a hotspot, you'll receive a souvenir photo to commemorate your visit. After 10 rounds, the game will go into overtime for 10 more rounds or until someone gets a souvenir photo. Oh. When the game ends, the player who has collected the most souvenir photos is the winner. Alright. 10 coins. Alright, it's ti It's now time for to announce the hotspots. Reading, please. Shopping trip. I vaguely remember playing this game when I was, uh... You know, when I was just a kid. So, it's still kind of new to me. First, you could travel to Japan and buy a folding fan. Or... We could go to India and buy some incense. Or we could go to Singapore and buy a handbag. It costs 10 coins to visit a hotspot and collect a souvenir photo. Alright, good luck everybody! Happy globetrotting! Thank you, Party Phil. Round 1. Of course, you have to start the game with a minigame. Crash Balls. Fun. Bye, Tommy. Bye, Sarah. And... Oh, come on. Get out of here. Still alive, huh? Bye now. Aha, I win. <clears throat> Though, to be fair, it's not that unexpected. This is beginner difficulty, after all. Right then, the results are in. This round, the order of play will be Kirby, Pony Maid, Mia, Sarah, and Tommy. Alright. So, where are we going? We have two 1 cards, two 2 cards, and one 3 card. The three active hotspots are displayed in the top right corner. One of these uh, icons and press A to see how to reach each one. Select the card and press A. Alright. Let's take a look at the map. Hold down A and move the Wii remote to rotate the globe. The airport and seaport icons show how far away from the closest ones you are. Alright. So we have an odd job, but we also have a shop. I'm going for 2. I guess three works as well. Point to a glowing space and press- Yeah, I know. I can also use the, uh, the arrow uh, thingies. The arrows. I can buy stuff. I'm gonna buy myself... A train card. Can I buy multiple? Yes. But a taxi is too expensive. This should do for now. Mia's up. Mia's gonna get a two. Or a one. Surprise! Pick one of the three cards. Oh, what does it do? What's that? An, a UFO? A UFO? A new UFO armada is coming to swap everyone's uh, places on the map. Or something like that. Great, so our places are being shuffled. So now Mia's over there. I'm back at the start. Sarah is at the start as well, and time is on the surprise space now. You gotta move one card. Great. But not really. Sarah bought herself a taxi. And then we have Tommy. Get a two- Oh, a one. Damn it. My, my intuition isn't really good today, huh? Oh well. Tommy got eight coins for his hard work. Ain't that nice. Lucky you. Oh, this one. This one's fun. Stand still and do absolutely nothing to win! Hopefully. Start. 
If I stood still, I would have uh, gotten it. Aha! Me and you, Mia. Aha! I win! Uh, if we use a train card, where can we go? I mean, I could use it, because why not? Let's go for the odd job. Three. Oh well. Fly to the airport of your choice. Oh. Interesting. Tommy, now you can't afford a hotspot anymore. Stupid. Smile snap. I win. I wonder who's gonna win the roll off. Of course Tommy won. Let's go for this one. Spin the wheel and win the amount shown from all players. Cha-ching. Six. I got six coins from everyone. All right, take six coins from each player. I'm gonna be rich. In fact, I am already. I am rich already. But I'm even richer than ever before. Fifty-six. And I got a move one card. Wait, Mia can. Oh no. Well, I guess Japan is from Mia then. Welcome to the, to Japan. All right, looks like Mia is in the lead for now. Not for long though. Ha, you missed me. Though to be fair, if I lost that mini game on beginner, I should be ashamed of myself. Oh, I got a one. Which means I can either go to the store or do a 1v1 and try to win coins. Yeah, but I have coins plenty, so let's go to the store. Buy ourselves a helicopter, <laughs> I guess. And a train card, for good measure. We'll replace the two. Oh, not that one again. I didn't even have a three at the moment. Oh wait, that, I, I needed a three if I was there. I don't know what I need now. What is that? Card grabber. You get to take one card from a random opponent. All right. As long as you don't take it from me, then it's all good. Oh, by your choice. <laughs> there goes your airport card. Why? Oh, you get to take five co coins from a random opponent. Please not me, even though I have coins plenty. Yes, payback, payback, Mia, payback's a bitch. And so are you. <laughs> you haven't done anything to piss me off yet, so I don't even know why I'm uh being mean to you. Well, guess who won? Me, obviously. Jeez, I just cannot seem to beat my record. Alright, well, I'll take the 5 card and move over to India. There we go. Buy some incense. You bought some incense in India. What a relaxing smell. Oh, Tommy's right next to it. What are the chances he's gonna get a 1? Pretty slim. 1 out of 5. He went over to the shop and bought a taxi for himself. Even though he doesn't have enough coins now, and there's no way he's gonna win the next minigame. Because I'm involved. Unless it's a luck-based minigame. Which it isn't. Chopper hoppers. You know, that one minigame no one likes. Let's go for the surprise. Coin grab. Oh wait, card grab. Coin grab. Tommy, I'm taking your tax. You uh, paid for 10 bucks. Coins, if you don't mind. Aha! 
What is that? Tornado. There's a tornado coming through. One player will be blown away. Mia. But where is she going, though? I pressed A on accident even though I wanted to read. Where are you going? Imagine if she landed right on the hotspot. Oh. She landed right next to Sarah. Interesting. Yeah, he's gonna get back at me. I knew it. Unless... Damn it. Screw you, Tommy. Even though it was your card. Oh wait, he's gonna take my helicopter card? That's not the card I took from you. Oh well. Like I said, the game encourages stealing. Easy enough. Finish. One. Hmm, you know what? Let's go over to the store. Maybe I could grab myself a nice card. Eh, that'll do. Oh. Fly to the hotspot of your choice. But why did you waste 20 coins for it? Because now you only have one coin and there's no way you're gonna be able to win the minigame. Because I'm involved. The game is almost over. From now on, the player in last place will choose the minigame. It's still anybody's game, so don't give up. Alright then, Party Phil. Sarah's in last place, so what minigame are we playing Pearl Plunder? Tah. <laughs> 12 pearls to their 3, 2, and 1. Oh, 3, 2, 2. Oh, now the music changes. Alright, so... Let's go... Let's... You know what? 3? Yes. Meaning I can go to the shop, buy myself a very... Mm, what? I want that card. Why does uh, Sarah get it? I want the, the the weird. What is this? Spin the wheel to ride the hot air balloon. The three to eight spaces. So that's basically an RNG based card. What is that? Everyone will gather at a random player space. Oh great! Now I'm even, uh, now I'm even further away from the the hot spot. And Timer was already here. Cosmic Capers. Do you actually think you can win against me in a button mashing race? Let me tell you, you won't. You can win. Not against me. New record. And Mia's in last place. That worked out perfectly. The hotspot's mine. So, if I'm correct, we get three new ones? That would make a great gift. Wait, I didn't buy that for myself? I mean, I don't really, I'm, I'm not really that, I'm not really a handbag guy, so... Time to announce the next three hotspots. Sightseeing. Alright then. First, you could travel to Canada and visit Whist Whistler Mountain, eh? You could also go to Mexico and see a mariachi band. Oh, it's all in America now, huh? Finally, why not go to Brazil and watch a soccer match? Football, soccer, it's whatever you want it to be. An English person calls it, uh, uh, football. An American person calls it soccer. And Mia flew over to Canada. Or... America in this case, not really Canada to be precise. She flew over to California? San Francisco maybe? I'm not sure. I'm not that good with the states. Derby Dash. Oh no. I was not paying attention. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I'm in third. Yeah, I thought so. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah, Sarah can fly over to the hotspot now. Wonder which which one? Oh, she's going to Brazil. You're going to Brazil. You watch a soccer match in Brazil. It's such a beautiful game. But isn't is Brazil mostly known for soccer? I'm pretty sure it was England, right? You know, with the Premier League and all. Yes! 
because now we get to go over to the airport and fly over to, to uh... Oh, it's the west coast. So we're speaking of San Andreas. And all those other states. Oh, I gotta move one card. Isn't that exactly what I need? Well, unless Mia steals it from me. Got a two! Yes! Perfect! That plays out in my favor! <clears throat> that did not play out, on my, play out in my favor. Please let me and Mia switch places. Please? No! Okay, that's Mia. No, don't send me all the way over there. Okay. Me? Or no, that's Tommy. Alright. Perfect. Still in first place. Ten rounds are over already. It looks like we're going into overtime. We'll play until a player lands on a hotspot or ten more rounds are up. The, uh, the player who lands on the final hotspot gets a bonus souvenir photo. Ain't that generous. Well done, Tommy. Oh, we're gonna be playing Space Brawl, huh? I won! Mia has zero points. Guess you're not really cut out, cut out for this, are you? This is not a cult. Apparently, uh, Sarah won. Alright, so are we going to Mexico or are we going to Canada? Let's go to Mexico. I want to see the mariachi band. Bring on the mariachi band! That's not mariachi! You saw a mariachi band in Mexico. They were so talented. They look like me's. This is the final hotspot, so you get a bonus souvenir photo. Great. And that marks the end, right? How long did that take? 45 minutes. So it can take up to 60 minutes. Alright, it's time to announce the results. In fourth place with zero photos and 26 coins, it's Tommy. In second place with one photo and... Wait, second place? Wait, did Mia and Sarah tie? Oh, that's something new, I guess. Four photos! With four photos and 69 coins, the winner is Creepy But Pony Made. Yay! I win! I wonder where the cheering was. Well... That was beginner difficulty. Next time when we come back to We Party... I, w I almost got one to call it We Party You, but it's We Party Globetrot. We're gonna be completing intermediate difficulty, or standard difficulty. Or whatever the hell you want to call it. I usually call it intermediate difficulty, but it is actually standard difficulty. But I will see you guys then.